I put the bulb in the ground weeks and weeks ago, where it could hide from winter's frost and snow. There it lies and shuts its eyes. When I had forgotten that I had put it there, it reached its green leaves out to test the warmth of the air. The bulb sits up in bed and puts its hands above its head. Round a purple flower, its green leaves opened wide, as if they were opening hands to show a present inside. Up it stands and stretches out its hands. Tulips are grown for their bulbs. They pick the heads off so that all the goodness goes back into the bulb. But so we don't waste the flowers, they're used as decorations in the flower parade. Peggy says it's story time now, and today's story is about going out in a car. It was a lovely day for a picnic. Meg, Mog and Owl wanted to go in a car. So Meg made a spell. Um, boot and bonnet, rattle and clang, make me a car that goes with a bang. Clink, clank. Lunk. Meow. Woo -hoo. Um, everybody's dream had almost come true. They all piled into the new car. Mog started the engine. Meow. Brrrr. The car shot backwards. Squaw crunch. Into a tree. Then lurched forward. Vroom, vroom, and sped off down the road. Toot, toot. It went with a bolt and a jolt, a thump, a bump, and a jump. Rattle, ouch, bang, help, tinkle, stop, and stopped. Ee, wee, woohoo, meow, clang. Meow, it needs petrol. Hoo-hoo, it needs oil. Um, just add an egg. The car started. It took off, flew through the air, and landed, crash, in a tree. So, they went to the picnic on the broomstick. <laughs> Good riddance. Peggy's going for a very special ride too. No, it's not on the broomstick with Meg and Mog and Owl, and it's not with Vanessa on the bike. Let's go and find out.
everyone's busy getting ready for the flower parade. And these are the bags of tulips they picked in the fields. And they use the tulip petals to colour in the shapes on the floats. Let's take a look around. Peggy spotted a tractor and even the wheels are made out of flowers. Hey Peggy, how about a slice of cake for tea? Peggy Patch's puzzle. Peggy can't wait for the flower parade. She wants to know which float she'll be riding on. And there's Peggy, riding with the dinosaurs. Doesn't this look fun? Hundreds and thousands of tulip petals have been used to decorate the floats. And listen to the music from the band. Here's something else that could go in the flower parade. Can you guess what it's going to be? Yellow petals as the wheels. And, and some red petals for the frame. It goes down in the middle. And up here, the handlebars. One each side. And dark purple petal as the saddle. It's a bicycle. It's right for riding around the tulip fields. Oh, there's the bus bell. Peggy, it's time to get back on the bus. I've got something for Peggy to take home with her. Some tulip petals so that she'll remember the flower patch. And I'll put them in the little patch pocket. Bye-bye. I think Peggy's pretending to be a tulip. Well, I'm off now to find my dinner. Bye, Peggy. Peggy will be in another patch next week. She'll see you there. Bye. <laughs>